So when we open up our Bibles to John chapter 16 verse 7 it says that nevertheless I tell you the truth it is to your advantage that I go away for if I do not go away the helper will not come to you but if I go I will send him to you I want us to uh, you know meditate on that word helper there you see the word helper comes from the greek word parakletos okay which means helper comforter or advocate okay now when we begin to see in hebrews chapter 13 verse 6 there also we see the writer say the lord is my helper i will not fear what can man do to me again we see declares there the scripture says the lord is my helper so when you take that word parakletos in the literal form it means someone who is called to come and stand alongside you yeah. just bring this picture to you before your eyes okay so someone who's coming or who is called to come alongside you so when you are going through a time where you feel you're weak he is alongside you yeah. as your helper oh. when you feel that you are going through a crisis he is the one who is alongside you to Don't. give you courage and strength when you are going through oppression or somebody is troubling you he is your defense because he is alongside you you know when you look at david facing goliath what would come to our mind is how could david have that boldness to fight goliath because he knew that god was with him As and someone? because god was alongside him to fight that back wow. i want you to realize that we have god with us As he is a parakletos a help He is available for us. So when you and I begin to seek God today, let's open up our hearts to him and say, God, touch us. Let's tell the Holy Spirit, I submit myself to you. You are my help. I cannot fight. I'm weak. I cannot overcome. I'm going through crisis, but with you as my helper, you my parakletos, you're standing along with me. I will overcome. Amen.